Hi, everyone, and thank you for joining us today. My name is Louis Guérin, and I'm here with my colleague, Christos Porius. We're both from the Harvard Kennedy School, and today we will present our research on assessing the neutrality of edits on Wikipedia that we conducted under the, super the supervision of Professor Bruce Schneier. Our motivation for this research stems from the increasing prevalence of misinformation and disinformation online. Wikipedia, as a major information source, is not immune to these issues. And our goal was to develop a tool that can assess the neutrality impact of individual edits to help maintain Wikipedia's credibility. To do this work, we had to start with MPOV, one of Wikipedia's core content policies that requires that all significant views published by reliable sources are represented fairly, proportionately, and as far as possible without editorial bias. And while this policy is praised for its intent, it's one of Wikipedia's three core content policies is non-negotiable. It's also been seen as mostly aspirational by a variety of researchers due to the challenges of maintaining true neutrality. I put here a few quotes from different uh, research studies we, we had a look at that point out that neutrality is often seen as a very local position, a policy that might have to be rewritten, uh, and is actually the most debated Wikipedia policy. For this research, we needed a case study, and we chose what we saw as one of the most controversial topics right now, working with the Wikipedia, Wikimedia Foundation. Um, we studied the ongoing war in the, the Gaza Strip as an example of a controversial topic subject to misinformation and disinformation. Here, just as an example, I put screenshots from three uh, different language Wikipedias of the same article. Um, this is the Israeli siege of Gaza City in Arabic, Hebrew, and English. Uh, the event is framed in different ways uh, on all of these different Wikipedias, sometimes as a war event, sometimes not. And we thought this was the perfect case study to have a look at neutrality. Um, before I hand it to, over to Christos, we want to stress that we want this research, to, we, we have a novel appro approach in this research. Unlike existing research on NPOV, we chose to focus on individual edits rather than the corpus of articles um, to look at the neutrality impact of selected edits. So to address the gap that uh, Louis mentioned, we developed a custom machine learning classifier that looks at individual edits of Wikipedia articles. We began by selecting 62 Wikipedia articles related to the Gaza Strip conflict, and we extracted a bit over 20,000 edits from these articles. We manually labeled 300 random edits to create our initial um, training set, uh, which we um, use as a gold standard in the table to the right. And our baseline comparison is GPT-4, uh, which classified edits with an accuracy of 64.5%. Uh, our classifier uses a variety of features, including username details, the content of the edit, and statistical data on past edits. We also incorporated the pre-existing Wikipedia language agnostic revert the risk risk model to predict the likelihood of an edit being reverted in the future. We then trained a neutral ne neural network on the um, on the labeled data. Our model achieved a precision recall AUC of uh, 0.71 and a weighted F1 score of 0.69, slightly outperforming the GPT-4 baseline. These results are promising in our opinion, especially considering uh, the limited amount of training data that we have for the study. And looking ahead, we actually want to improve those results and improve the performance of our model by doing two things. This is on the right part of the slide. Uh, first, we want to label more data. Um, ideally, we could reach a data set of at least a thousand uh, Wikipedia edits um, to train our classifier and improve its performance. And second, we want to extract more features, including the page's ORS score, the editor's tenure and behavior outside uh, the article, um, or a reliability assessment of the sources being added or removed. So we're currently working on that. Um, and in terms of use cases and um, and how we want to use this uh, classifier, we've seen we see two two main examples. First, for the community, um, this classifier could be used to flag potentially NPOV decreasing edits, generate discussions on talk pages, and ensure that such edits um, are quickly discussed when they are made. Second, uh, we also want to 
use the tool in a more analytical way. Um, our main hypothesis with that research is that the share of NPOV decreasing edits um, tends to decrease over time. And we want to prove that by looking at NPOV decreasing and NPOV increasing edits over time uh, for a given article. So in conclusion, um, this research uh, provides a novel approach to assessing the neutrality of Wikipedia edits. We look at the individual level rather than at the corpus of articles. Uh, by doing so, we hope to uh, contribute to the ongoing efforts to ensure that Wikipedia remains a reliable, uh, trusted and unbiased source of information. We thank you for your attention and we look, look forward to answer, answering any questions you may have. Thank you so much.